I am packing for our trip to San Diego. First thing I do when I'm traveling anywhere, regardless of how long the trip is, where the trip is, is check the weather. So in San Diego, it's going to be pretty warm the whole time we're there. Not excruciatingly hot, thank goodness, because we'll... Uh, but warm enough that I'm bringing shorts for pretty much the whole trip. I will be bringing like a couple pairs of pants because there are a few days that it's going to be cool enough to wear pants, but pretty much bringing shorts for everybody for the whole trip. Other than that, uh, because it's San Diego, it's sunny, going to be bringing a hat. I know I'm going to need sunscreen and sandals for, you know, the times that People who wear shoes are going to be wearing shoes. Um, I am going to bring a pair of flip-flops for myself. Sometimes going through airports, um, airplanes, people are kind of about shoes. So I, I always do have a pair of flip-flops with me when I'm going to be flying or traveling anywhere for that matter. Uh, it's just kind of a matter of common sense. <laughs> so of course I will have those. Um, my son's going to have uh, like those hiking sandals. He's really into those right now. And, um, my husband's just gonna wear what he always wears, sneakers. And he, he, he's rocking the like 40 year old dad outfit, <laughs> the sneakers and, and the like athletic material shirt and the elastic waistband pants. He, he's got it down even before he was a stepdad. <laughs> it was great. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get back to packing and I'll show you what I've packed once I've got it all in the suitcases. I am getting there. Uh, I think I may actually have to go through and uh, <laughs> got quite the stack of pants and shorts there. So I may actually have to downsize because overpacking is not something I want to do. Even though this suitcase does have quite a large capacity. And then my son's pile is quite small. I'm just going through my laundry and sticking everything in the suitcase right now might not be the best plan okay i downsized for me i am taking seven shorts three leggings nine t-shirts and one tank top now to make sure my son has enough because he did not put his clothes in the laundry now i gotta go dig through his room and find what we're gonna take okay my son has nine pairs of shorts and one pair of pants he has 10 t-shirts and i packed him an extra pair of underwear I've got my clothes, my hat, my bathing suit. Now to tackle my husband's suitcase. My husband gets six shirts, two pairs of pants, and two pairs of shorts. There's a reason for this. I won't go into it in this, but um, <laughs> anyways, he's getting the carry-on bag. Um, my laptop's also going to go in here. And anything else we need to have access to while on the plane that won't fit in our personal bags. And the rest of our toiletries and things like that that can go under the plane will go in our checked bag. We're only taking the carry-on, the checked bag, and then our personal bags. I'm kind of cursed when it comes to losing luggage, so fingers crossed that if nothing bad happens on this trip, but I'm going to be shoving an outfit for each of us in our personal items just in case. So, of course, I've got all my toiletries. Anytime you're traveling, whether by car or by plane, I recommend putting your liquids in a zipped bag. This is to prevent them, if they do leak, from getting all over everything, which sometimes that's gonna happen, just being honest. So I'm taking with me uh, body wash, shampoo, conditioner, toothpaste, uh, toothbrushes, deodorant, moisturizer, toner, sunscreen, all that good stuff. Uh, if you think there's anything I've forgotten, please tell me now. Oh, and obviously we're taking medications. When you're traveling with medications, um, they have to be in the original container provided by the pharmacy. And you can only take um, for people who are traveling with you if you're flying. The person who's like if they're prescription medication, you have to have the name uh, match the name on the ticket or you could run into issues uh, getting through security. So, yeah, our flight leaves in time is at... Uh, 12, 14, 21 hours. So I'm pretty excited. So yay. Um, I'll see you in San Diego. If there's anything you think I'm forgetting, please comment and tell me before I get on that plane. Bye.